back with Meyer. You're always looking back. Index it. Start it. Yeah, right. Close. Now, from the sitting position. From the position. Tap it back. Move yourself to position and hover right here and say. The harder you hit it, the harder you hit it. Right, don't be scared. Clear. 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 Because what that does is saying the gun's clear and now you're clear. And when you put them on, I guess be careful for dimpling the battery. I think when it's like flush with the lip, it's about good. Oh, it's uh, based off of the desert. It's not got branch, like the ear Double ear Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. So you're saying it's got a tight arrow or anything? It made sense in my head. No, no, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. We'll work it. Yeah, we'll work it. Right over left. 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 That we have set up, and then they're going to go to their firing points with their instructors. That next group of six will be immediately staged behind them at the ASP. All right, they're going to six of marine six marines. And they're going to walk up here, all right? Those six Marines in those uh, first stages will be SOI East Marines, all right? Ready. Ready to fire. Back by three, all clear. Fire, fire, fire. So what Yeah. 
Can we? Just whatever you do, don't lean on the weapon. All right, don't lean on the weapon. Right, so I'm Sergeant David Begel. I'm from 1st Battalion, 2nd Marine Regiment, and I'm in an Alpha Company. I'm a squad leader. So today we're uh, utilizing the Carl Gustav for the MOS system. Um, it's a uh, rocket uh, propelled system. You can use multiple, uh, multiple types of rounds, smoke, loom, uh, high explosive, high explosive dual purpose, uh, air burst. Um, so it's, it's utilized pretty much to replace the law and the AT4 systems that we have right now. So today we're firing uh, training rounds as well as some high explosive and high explosive dual purpose rounds um, to just familiarize Marines with uh, 1st Battalion, 2nd Reg, as well as uh, instructors from the School of Infantry because uh, it's being a new weapon introduced to our battalion and this just familiarizes us and we can uh, bring this information back to the Marines back in our unit. In almost every operation that we do, um, when we patrol, when we do urban operations, we do, um, even when we're just patrolling the woods, we always carry a rocket because you don't know where, you know, what unit we're going up against, what kind of enemy that we have, what capabilities they have. So this gives us a wide range of uh, opportunities and assets that we have. We can use it to uh, create, uh, use smoke, use a loom at night, and we can see the battle space or uh, just simply damage a vehicle or um, take out you know, just infantry in the field. The purpose is to uh, definitely neutralize and destabilize the enemy's forces, um, disrupt their, what they plan on doing. Um, it gives us ability to maneuver and move our forces into more advantageous positions. I do not. Um, I know it was created a long time ago, back in the 50s, and they've just been continuously uh, upgrading it and promoting it. Um, I know the Army uh, has been using this as well as uh, Marine Corps Special Forces, uh, MARSOC teams, they've been using this weapon um, overseas on deployments and training. Uh, now we're, it's finally being implemented to the uh, infantry battalions. Currently now we'll be, uh, we'll be mostly replacing the uh, AT-4 as well as the LA rocket launchers because um, this has far more uses and versatility than the other ones. And with this we carry less rounds, it's lighter, and it's just a, a more versatile weapon system. Uh, pros is the, the sight you can use at night, you can use with optics, without optics. Um, it automatically adjusts to the range that you need, as well as you can uh, lead vehicles that are moving. You can lead the vehicle and actually shoot ahead of it, and we pinpoint actually every single time. Um, so that's one that's definitely one of a huge pro. Uh, con is that it needs two people to use it, um, but at the same time, if those two Marines, the, a, the gunner and the A-gunner, uh, if they train, they continuously work on the craft, uh, they can get around six to seven rounds a minute, which is far better than just a one-time use for the other rockets.